Alright, so I'm going to edit some of that out. I found the solution, I think, which is one here, one here, and one way over here. Now what I think this is actually going to allow me to do is come on up here and when these fire off those three there I think I can jump down thusly there we go on the shot side give him some time to get used to you all right we made it through another puzzle how terribly exciting okay some dimensions are tightly bound together like the one we're in right now and also the fluffy and heavy dimensions. Awaited decision. Alright, so we're probably going to need this doohickey in here. Why do they have four slots on these things, I wonder? Why can't I put it back in either? Um, go. Why are you being annoying? Do I have to pick it up this way and like, yeah, I do. I do indeed. I guess I must have the four so that I can control the four different uh, doohickeys. Weight things, that I should say. That red battery will provide enough energy to enable the ITS device to widen the heavy dimension rifts in this area. There we go. So you gotta point them straight in, it looks like. And apparently it doesn't really matter where I put it, so there we go. Alright, so what does this do exactly? Can I... Huh. So what this does. It works. How awesome is that? Now why is this all... It appears this dolly got stuck on an infinite loop. How unfortunate. Well, I should be able to bust that. There we go. Can I make it? Yeah, I can go in here now. Cool. And probably gotta. Oh, can I see this is fluffy? That was not as cool as I thought it was gonna be. I totally thought that was gonna be awesome, but it was not. So probably do the opposite of what I usually do. Maybe I need to like make it super light, and then I think I have to be closer try that. There we go. There seems to be a large expanse of piles and pits filled with various random objects. You know, all lag there no, for some not reason. Where you are here in this confounded place. Are those hard candies? They're a little fuzzy. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Stairway to Fluffy, what's going on in here? Nice job. No, not really. <laughs> Alright, so I can make things heavy. Does that make it laser proof, I wonder? With the increased density and higher melting points of items in heavy dimension, quadrangle laser beams are rendered rather ineffectual. Good to know. That is good to know. What is this gonna do? Probably something that requires heaviness, right? Oh! I gotta make a staircase, I think. Uh, that didn't really come out very good. I gotta say. Let's try this again. So we need one block left over there so I can jump up. I screwed that up entirely. Well, Alright, most just... things in life, timing is key. And is it gonna have one more go left at it? It is. Sweet, I think that will work. Let's turn this on just to be careful in case it wants to turn on the laser again for some unfortunate reason. What have we got here? I came across Ike some hey, little guy. Though, and he decided to follow me back to the manor. Let's plop this thing in here. There we go. We are all set. Now... Set to do what, I guess, is the question. I got my fluffiness. Where do I need to even go? 
What is this? I believe Ike stole these and hid them at one point. He's rather fond of shiny objects. Well, who isn't? Who isn't, I say? Alright, so what's going on out here? I really am not entirely sure where I want to go here. I guess through here. So I guess what we'll have to do is make this fluffy. Do I, th I must have to like throw it and then turn it solid. Oh, that almost worked. But not quite. Wow, it's like blinding. Let's like toss it against the wall, I think will probably be a better idea. There we go. Not half bad. So what is going on in this next area? This was once the family cat, Lord Widget Pompadour Fluffington the Fourth. Wow. Or Widget the First. He's an awesome cat. Alright, well the Note blue laser that if you disrupt the blue beam, it should deactivate something. Okay. Good to know. What does this button do? It drops the thing that I need. And then it smushes everybody with a billion safes. That's great. That is apparently this unit needs a little bit of work. Um Well, I can disrupt the blue beam with just like any old thing. That's good to know. No, I have to like straighten this thing out, aren't I? There we go. So we got our fluffy going. Um, probably want to reactivate that, those because I don't need to be there anymore. What does deactivating this laser do for me exactly? God. Ah. That just opens that door. I'm so we need to bring my sure stack out this way. That Probably a lot. Whoa, the fan screws everything up. Good to know. Oh, we can get this doohickey. We can definitely get this doohickey. And there we go. We got our heavy going. That's going to be like way too heavy for me to actually do this, though. Hmm. What would I actually be able to put on that? Because everything is going to get blown away. This is not going to work out. Um. So I can stand on that and deactivate it for whatever good that does, which would be like no good. Aha, uh -huh, I. I'm an idiot. The safe won't move. I don't think the safe will move. If I put it on normal weight again, and then I should be able to place my block. Make it heavy, and it will blow away. Cool. But now the door is not open. What opens this door? Are you getting me? Do I have to block this laser again or something? If I block this one, that just shuts that, right? Press the button, see what that does. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. Now I just need my stupid cardboard box back. Where's my cardboard box? Oops. I know what I need to do, but I'm just making this more difficult than it needs to be, because I'm an idiot. See, there I go again. There I go again. No! I did not want to press... <sighs> Let 
let's try that again. Make sure we're lined up correctly here. Do not press E again by mistake. And we'll make this line up and heavy. And then I should be able to just turn off the heavy. There we go. 